All right, nerds, we are back for IP April, and bleh. All right, nerds, we are back for IP April, and this one, this one might raise some shackles. From Odin Brewing, Galactic Space Dragon IPA, Odin Brewing, Brewed and Canned at Craft Collective Brew Works, who do Spectrum, not Spectrum Ale Works that you saw earlier, Spectrum, as in like the small silver cans, that are super controversial. You either love them or you hate them. And I did a show about them. And there's a lot of controversy about it. I don't care. I like beer. This is an IPA. It is IPA April. We're going to get down to this. All right. So this one has Idaho 7, Calypso, and El Dorado. So a lot of hops. Um, but luckily, they're all a little different. So Idaho 7, let me crack this. You're going to get tangerine, you're going to get some herbal flavors, almost like Earl T. Uh, El Dorado, you're going to get like tropical and resinous and you want to eclipse there, you're going to get some citrus and fruitiness. Um, it's a little bit of everything. El Dorado probably for the hop. We'll see. Um, let's pour this. We'll get talking. So this is, before I pour it, 6.5%. Fairly strong. It says it's tropical, juicy, hoppy. Um, with the hops used, it should be kind of dank. If that makes sense, you know the word dank used in beer. So let's pour this. Um, yeah, it's actually pouring like fairly... I expected kind of like a more West Coast look out of this, but just because of where it's from. But it's actually pretty orange. Look at that. A nice orange color. One, yeah, one finger white head. Really, really juicy looking. Really juicy looking. Again, this is Odin Brewing, who aren't always considered a craft beer to everybody. I don't care. Um, well, at least Spectrum's not really craft, according to most people, because um, they're owned by a big company, and this is owned by a big company. Let's try it out. Let's get right to the aroma. Let's see if we get the tropical, the juiciness. Uh, and what was the other one? Hoppy. Tropical, juicy, hoppy. I mean, so it's an IPA. Yeah, you get... It's funny because you get dankness bang right off the bat. Like wet forest floor. Wet forest floor, almost like... Yeah, I was going to say marijuana, but not really. The wetness, there's a lot of minerality to it. Minerality, gotcha Kelly. Um, it's not super, it has a bit of stone fruit pithiness, like that smell of the inside of a stone fruit, like a, a peach, plum, that kind of stuff. Um, quite herbal. And there's like a little bit of a bite if you get really, really in there. Like citrus, muddled tropicalness. And again, that might be a stone fruit. Stone fruit, tropical, kind of like mix hand in hand a little bit. Weird softness, like pear or something maybe, I don't know. I don't really get like tangerine. I don't get orange. Fairly muddled. Expectedly so. Let's try it. Um, this used to be kind of a go-to at one of the local pubs because it was pretty strong beer. It doesn't say the IBUs on it though, I don't think. I'm expecting a fair amount of hoppiness actually, if I remember right. I don't know, it's really cool art though, like dragons and space and stuff, of course. So, let's get to it. We've talked aroma, mottled, dank, earthy. Let's get to Let's get to the flavor and see if we get any of these. Yeah, super dank. Very herbal. It has some like bergamot qualities to it, which are raisiny. Lots of tropical, very resinous. Kind 
Okay, so I don't like this beer. I, I, I remember liking it before on tap. I don't know what it is. Maybe my taste just changed. The fruit's super muddled. And it has like, it's very herbal. Like Earl Grey, Bergamo kind of stuff coming through. But there's something else in there. It's like... I don't like bile. I know it sounds weird and really disgusting. And this beer isn't disgusting. Um, it's just not good. There's this tanginess to it. This acidity. Yeah, I don't know if this beer is bad or what, but my God, it's not very good. They... I don't know. I don't know what it is. Weird hop combination. Tried too hard. The beer's not. A, is it West Coast? Is it hazy? Is it an IPA? Is it. Oh, man. Yeah. This is like one of the worst beers I've ever reviewed, honestly. And it's really weird because I'm sure I've had this before and I'm sure I really liked it. But I'm not going to have, even have another drink. I dislike it that much. It's like they took all these ingredients, left it out into the sun and then fermented it. <laughs> Maybe this review won't raise many hackles because... I talk shit about it and it's a shit beer so I guess I'm right in line with everybody else man I hate your bad reviews and make me feel bad uh, but if your beer sucks your beer sucks um, and I've done a few other bad reviews but is this the most negative one I've ever had I think so I think so um, Oh, fuck, I want to delete this review, but I'm not going to. I'm going to put it up. I'm going to take a brave face. Take one in the chin. If the brewery doesn't like it, too bad. Um, this beer sucks. Don't drink it. you learn a lot in IP April. Um, if you like this beer, and you think I'm a complete weirdo, and I'm completely wrong, leave a comment below. Or hit me up on social media, at Fermented Nerds. I'm going to hit all this stuff. Um... Subscribe or unsubscribe, uh, depending on what you think about this review. I hope you subscribe and leave a thumbs up. Or regardless, just give me one today. Um, yeah, Galactic Space Dragon from Odin Brewing. One more beer I don't have to buy ever again. Uh, sweet. So bad. Ugh. I almost don't want to do another review. I just want to drink some beer to get my mind off this. Uh, some good beer. But and that's probably what I'll do. I'm so, so disappointed. <laughs> I'd rather have one of their Spectrum beers. I'd rather have that white chocolate garbage they make. Um, some of the other beers are good. Margaritas and stuff. But that white chocolate is awful. This is terrible. Terrible. Okay, I'm going to quit bitching. Uh, this is not rated for children. All that said, uh, check us out at Fermented Nerds. I'm sure I've mentioned that. You know what to do social media-wise. Um, I'm Wally. This is Fermented Nerds. I'm out.